Today I'm gonna be filming another cut crease using the using the same There's only one. What's up guys? I'm back with a new video. Today I'm gonna be filming another cut crease using the same method I used in my last cut crease video, which should be the video just before this one. I'm gonna be doing sort of a winter wonderland look using blues. Um, I love blue eyeshadow, blue is my favorite color, and it's winter time, so I was just kind of inspired by the winter season. And I'm not going to be showing my face makeup, just the eye makeup in this video, because it's just getting repetitive because I'm always using the same products. I just tend to always use the same products once I start using something and I really like it. My new uploading schedule is going to be Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Sundays. That's going to be the uploading schedule for the next few weeks until I start school again, basically. And then I'm going to go back to just uploading on Sundays. So today I'm going to be using the Urban Decay Electric Palette and the Meat Matte Nude Palette. Because I just feel like I'm getting kind of bored with a lot of YouTubers that I'm watching lately. And I mostly watch beauty gurus because they're just all doing the same types of videos, which is barely any makeup tutorials but when they do do makeup tutorials they're all like the same like all over youtube like i'm trying to find new beauty gurus to watch and everyone's just doing the same makeup looks i feel like there's just not a lot of creativity happening right now so i'm trying to be very creative and i love being creative with my makeup so we're gonna do uh oh and i didn't mention we're gonna do like a gradient blue cut crease let's get started first i'm gonna go in with the shade gonzo which is a beautiful peacock blue and I'm going to start carving it, my crease out right here. About a third in. You just want to have a really steady hand. And then for the middle, I'm going to go in with Chaos. And then lastly, I'm going to go in with a navy color for my Meet Matte Nude Palette, Matte Johnson. I have a ton, in, a ton of other navy eyeshadows, but they're just not really pigmented. Yes! So now I'm going to start filling in each one. So I'm going to go in with Chaos and like just add some on top. And then I'm going to go in and blend it. I'm just using the same brush because, like, they're all blue shades. But I would still have used the same brush anyways. I do not have a lot of eyeshadow brushes. I always keep telling myself I need to buy more. And then Matt Johnson. <sighs> so cool. Okay. And just start blending each shade out. And I just really want it to be visible that there's three different colors. In my head, they were more like alike, the colors, but they're just very different. But I didn't want to just do one shade because I, I plan to just use Chaos and just do a cut crease. But I'm like, no, that's kind of boring. Just one color. I already showed how to do that in my last video with just like a brown. So I thought, okay, let me just use like a bunch of colors. And I really hope like you guys try out cut creases after watching this. Because like, they're just so awesome. And then Matt Johnson. So just be very light-handed when you come to the end. Oh yeah, my eyebrows, I did them a thinner today because, I don't know, I was just feeling a thinner, more Kendall Jenner eyebrow today. Last video was Kylie, today Kendall. So I'm just going to keep further blending it out. I feel like my left eye is messier than my right eye, but every time I do a cut crease, 
once you do one eye it's just so difficult to get it exactly perfect like the other eye so anyways now i'm gonna go oh i just highlighted my brow bone with a white eyeshadow because now on the lid i'm gonna go in with revolt revolt is this really nice silver glittery shade and i'm gonna take this real techniques small detail brush onto my lid And also, you know, define the crease. Maybe I should have, like, kept a space in between. I also have that NYX Blue Mascara that I had mentioned in my last haul. It was like a try-on haul. But it's a pastel blue, so I don't think I'm going to use it. So yeah, I'm just going to keep building this up to my liking. And I'm going to do winged eyeliner as well. This is pretty much one eye done. Here's my finished Winter Wonderland makeup tutorial. I really hope you guys enjoyed this look. I will just show you the eyes more close. Because of my eye shape, the shimmery shade transferred onto my cut crease. But looking here now, not really that much. I just kept um, dusting it off throughout me doing the rest of my makeup. I kept the rest of my makeup very cool toned with the highlight and the lips and the blush as well. But if you prefer me showing my face makeup on camera, just simply let me know. Let me know any video suggestions that you'd like to see from me. Subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see future videos of mine. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed so I know to do more creative looks more often. Follow me on Instagram, Visco and Tumblr. The links are always down below if you'd like, of course. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you soon. Bye.